Hello everyone, welcome to Think Computer YouTube channel. In this video, I will explain about conditional programming in Java. So, conditional programming are of two types. One is called bidirectional conditional programming and another one is called multidirectional conditional programming. Okay. In bidirectional conditional programming, we have if else statement. And in multidirectional conditional programming, we have switch case. So, in this video, I will be explaining about if else statement that is bidirectional conditional programming. What's the difference? I can tell you. In bidirectional conditional programming, you are writing one condition, and because of the condition, the outcome of the condition can be true or false, means it can go in one direction or in second direction. So, there are only one out of two things, okay. But in multi-directional conditional programming, we don't have conditions, we have options or choices. So there what happens is that user enters a number or a value. Based on that value, one out of many things can happen. So that is done in switch case. If else statement. So this is the general uh, format or syntax of if else statement. We write if, we write a condition and there is a true statement and there is a false statement okay if the condition is correct then it will enter the if block this part is called if block and if the condition is not correct then it will go to else at a time only one of the block will execute that means if block will execute then else block will not execute and if the condition is wrong then only else block is executing if block will not execute okay for an example suppose that uh, int x equal to 5 and uh, y equal to 10 so if i write if x less than y then z equal to 20 else z equal to x plus y notice that in the format i have given curly braces but in the example i have not given if you are writing only one statement then curly braces giving or not giving is same means it's not important to give curly braces you can give no problem so here the condition is x less than y so when we frame condition we use uh, logical operators and uh, relational operators so using those operators we have written a condition here if the condition is correct then z will get the value 20 otherwise z will get the value of x plus y okay this is the general format of if else statement 